channel. For those of you that are new, my name is Nunu. And if you are new and like what you see, please consider subscribing. So, first off, I do want to say thank you to each and every one of you for being a part of my YouTube family. As always, I am so very grateful from the bottom of my heart. And if you are new, welcome. If you like what you see, definitely subscribe. I have a lot of good stuff coming up, so hopefully... Um, you guys will see that soon but for today i do have a what's in my purse video featuring the steve madden purse that i got on timu a while back i've yet to use it and finally i am able to use it so definitely stay tuned because we're about to get into that shortly but first off how are you all doing today um it's sunday it's a rainy gloomy day it feels beautiful out even though it's rainy, of course, but it's nice to have that calm, soothing weather. At least for me, it goes with my vibe, kind of like I'm feeling like in that um, kind of like romantic, gloomy type of feeling. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. But do y'all like my hair? I decided to change the color. Um, I did this yesterday. It didn't take long at all. Um, it's so pretty. Look how beautiful it is. Of course, I do have extensions to match because my hair is definitely not this long. I hope long. you guys like it. It is so pretty. Look how pretty this color is on me. Um, I think the last time that I did like a brown hair color, it was a little bit lighter than this. It was maybe when my son was in pre-K and that's about six almost six years ago so it's been a while i was just like in the mood of changing it up and um i had that impulse so i didn't even think about it i went to get i, I went to get it done it just got done and i hope you guys like it because this is the color that i'm feeling for the fall vibe it's going to be sticking around for quite a while i'm definitely going to keep it up in hopes that i don't go back to black anytime soon because this color is such a vibe look at how pretty very very pretty i love it but let's go ahead and get on to the desk so i can show y'all what's in my purse and let's go let's go ahead and do a little slow mode of the purse for those of you that did not see this in a previous video um i want to show y'all what the purse looks like so once again i did get this purse on timu as a steve madden purse it's so so pretty look at how pretty that i love to do for you guys that i love to show y'all this purse is so cute to wear i love it i cannot wait to actually start using it i literally just switched my stuff into it today so i've yet to take it out um but i can't wait to actually you know go out and use my purse but um it is so cute let me go ahead and show you everything that's inside i do want to stay in the camera because i'm feeling myself i think i look so cute today so so like I said, in this part, let me go ahead and bring y'all closer. So come on. This little pouch is a little pacifier pouch where you can put your, your baby's pacifier in it. Um, but of course I did get her on Shein in my last haul if you guys missed it. Um, but I decided to make it a little coin purse. I thought it was so cute. Look at the colors on it. Very, very pretty and unique. And when you open it up, all I literally have in there are coins and nothing else. And then I have this little pom-pom. I don't know where I got it, but it's just a regular pink pom-pom. Could have been Simu, could have been Shein. I don't know. So I just added that on there to make it cute. And then on this side, I have this little bear keychain that i got on timu and it says cute head it says cute head on it so it's like cute you know and this is the um 
the Steve Madden bag strap. And this is like the Steve Madden Beverlyn bag. If you guys would like to get one, it's called a Steve Madden Beverlyn bag. But look at the strap. This is one of the things that caught my attention is this really cute strap. It says Steve Madden on it. The color is absolutely gorgeous. I love it. This is the back of the purse. This is what the side looks like. And then before we open it up, it has this handle right here. It has a zipper compartment and this right here. In this pouch, what do we have? Not much. I have my a little Hello Kitty purse. I've yet to take anything out. This is exactly the purse I had in my last video. And all I have in this little pouch is wet wipes. Literally, that's it. Just wet wipes. Um, so that's one of the things that I got in there. And then I have um, this high chew little candies in this little bag. And in this little tiny pouch that you can use for your tissue, your feminine products, I decided that I didn't want a wallet in this purse. All I did was go ahead and throw my money and my cards in there. Literally, that is it. So all my little stuff is in there. And it's nice and flat and cute. And I can just leave it right here. And then so that is literally all I have in here. As you guys can see, there is nothing else. Nothing. And it's a pretty good pocket. It's very deep, definitely. So moving on to the next compartment, guys. I have a couple goodies in here. I have my little Tylenol container, of course. I have uh, this little brush, which I'm happy I have it because I can kind of like um, brush my hair. It's a little detangled. So that is why I like to keep my brush. Never know when you're gonna need it. So yes. Um, and then I have um, this, my little, uh, which I'm like so obsessed with, this little Dove hand sanitizer I've been enjoying. Um, and then the last thing I have in this pouch is this little container here. Now this you can use for like your electronics, your chargers, your um, iPad accessories, your Apple Watch accessories, whatever. I decided that I wanted to use it as a little makeup compartment. Um, I thought it was cute. And in here I have my Hello Kitty mirror. I have my Maybelline Super Stay Contour Stick. Or at least I like to use it. It's a foundation. It's a multi-use foundation stick. But I love this color so that I can contour. Because let me tell y'all. If you do not contour and you have like a double chin. Definitely consider learning techniques. Because it really does help and conceal that double chin area. So I'm like obsessed with my contour stick. I love it. And um, literally it just it, it makes my makeup look even nicer you know. So um, anyways, and then I have this um, LA Colors lip liner that I've used a couple of times. I have my NYX. This is a Milky Gloss in the shade Cookies. So I have that one there. Um, I have my CoverGirl Easy Breezy Brow in the color Rich Brown, which is what I have on my eyebrows right now. Um, I have my e.l.f. eyeliner. Um, I have my Paris Hilton perfume that I love because it reminds me of high school. And the last thing I have in here is my Revlon Kiss Plumping Lip Cream. And yes, that is all that I have in here as you guys can see. Um, so that is literally everything that's in my bag. If I am missing anything, I think it would be like my Lysol wipes, um, my AirPods, and what else am I missing in my bag? That I usually use. I guess like my tissues. I have not transferred those over yet. Other than that I think we're good. I think that's it. Literally that's all I have in my purse these days. I do not use much. So yes. Anyways I am going to go ahead and do a quick fast kind of speed thing music situation. Where I just show y'all me putting everything back in my bag. And that will be it. Let's go. <laughs>
I hope you guys did enjoy my what's in my purse video. And I do want to remind each and every one of you to find something creative, something inspiring, something that sets your soul on fire and bloom. See you all in my next video. Bye.